Yo, what up, what up, what up? It's your boy Sensei on Beats, and you are tuned in to Real Talk. <laughs> I know. I know. Calm down. Calm down. So listen, let's talk about Usher and Alicia Keys. But before we do that, man, I need y'all to go like this video, get us in the algorithm, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And... uh Visit musicdiarygroup.com for some inspirational music, all right? So let's talk about Usher and Alicia. Do you think Usher was being disrespectful at the Super Bowl when he grabbed Alicia Keys? Think about it for a second. <whistles> Boom. I don't think he was disrespectful. A lot of people saying, oh, he was disrespectful. You know, he shouldn't have grabbed her like that and he shouldn't have been trying to be booed up with her. I don't think that's what it was. Um, I think this is entertainment. I think um, he wouldn't do anything like that in front of millions of people. People want to see a show, right? And I guess they got a show. But, you know, dang if you do, dang if you don't. If he didn't give people a good show, you wouldn't have anything to, to, to talk about. Like, it's always going to be something negative, no matter what you do, right? So, yeah, um, even Alicia Keys' husband, with Swiss Beats, was telling people, man, come on. Y'all worried about the wrong thing. It's not even about that, yo. It's about providing a service, which was the service entertainment fun right they did a song called my boo so if any anything it was about the song man my boo my boo my baby my girl like you know what i'm saying my yo that's my it's my shorty right there so i you know i don't know man people people are funny people are picky they say um if I was Swiss Beats, I wouldn't allow that to happen. One rapper was like, yo, Usher need to apologize to Swiss Beats. Why? Usher didn't do anything wrong. Okay, let's take it a step further. What if this was a movie and he had to, um, this was, that was part of a scene that he had to do. Will people say that still? You know, that's crazy. That's, this is crazy to me, man. But you got to also remember, people's going to talk about anything at any time in any place. That's what real talk is, man. We talk about any time, <laughs> talk about anything, anytime, any place, anywhere. So just because I got a background behind me, you know what I'm saying? We in front of a camera. Yo, I travel a lot. So I could talk about anything. I could go anywhere and talk about whatever I like, right? So, and and you may like this and you may not like it, right? But the point is, Somebody always got something to say. That's the point. What people should be talking about is her singing. Now, I'm not going to go too hard on her because we come from the Rough Riders. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Yonkers, Y.O., baby. So I'm not going to go too hard on her like that. But Alicia Keys could not find the key, man, to her singing. Usher had to come over there and save her. That's what people should be talking about, yo. Yo, when she came out and started singing that joint, I was like, yo, ho, ho. I couldn't even give her claps, yo. I was like, yo, I hope Usher come out and save her. And he did. He did, yo. She couldn't get it together. But, yo, Alicia, you got to start practicing, yo. You a musician. You got to keep your voice on point. I mean, come on, man. I understand sometimes you can't hear yourself in a in a little earpiece. You know what I'm saying? When you're doing live shows. But, yo, that was horrible. That was horrible. And another joint that I know probably a lot of people didn't catch. Well, Usher almost fell and bust his chops on the skates when he was doing the song with Will I Am. Yo, I noticed that. I was like, yo, she almost bit the ground. And he did a skate around, like, I think he skated, like, twice around, like, in this little circle 
to make it seem like he ain't do that. You know what I'm saying? He kept it moving. You got to respect that. <laughs> yeah. You got to respect Usher, boy. He almost, boo. He almost hit that ground, yo. But to go back, man, Usher, I don't think he did anything disrespectful. disrespectfully. I think he's just selling records, you know, giving people a performance, giving people a show, as though he should, man. Just like Alicia. So, you know, I know people hate on Alicia because of what happened. We ain't even going to speak about that because I got respect, you know what I'm saying, for them. I can't, I can't, I can't do, I can't say certain things, you know what I'm saying, right now. Not on Alicia. Nah, I won't, I won't do it. But people hate her because she did certain things. At least the world feel like she did certain things, which, hey, whatever. We, we going to get off that, though. But, um, yeah, uh. She sucked singing. Yeah, <laughs> that was horrible, man. But that's my two cents on it, on this whole Alicia Keys and Usher situation. That's my two cents. People have something to say about anything and everything, man. So I personally feel like he, he didn't mean no harm. This was just performing. He's selling records in front of millions of people. What the freak make you think he's going to do something in front of millions of people? I don't know. I don't know what people thinking, but whatever. That's just my opinion. And I had to speak about it. Why? Because it's trending. Yeah, so don't forget to like this joint. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Visit us at musicdiarygroup.com. And if you're over there on Instagram, yo, check us out too. Music underscore, music underscore diary underscore group yo i'll butcher that all up music underscore diary underscore group <laughs> i got problems man but anyway i'm out of here that's my two cents that's my take on it um y'all be good to the next time you know stay tuned man that's the only thing i can say to y'all peace